Good morning. For those of you who have purchased a Mr. Coffee IDS 77 model um, coffee maker, when you first take this out of the box, it seems like it only has about four inches worth of cord. And it's very, uh, initially, you get this much cord, I think, sticking out. Okay? And obviously, as you can see here, you've got at least a foot and a half, if not two feet of cord. And what happens is that the cord is really wrapped around the inner base here. So you have to sort of take it out of, the, out of this little notch, pull it out of the notch, and then unwind it from this inner, inner recess, or whatever you want to call it, and then it will come out. Uh, I almost took this right back to Walmart. Uh, I, couldn't, I couldn't believe the audacity of Mr. Coffee that they would have put such a very short, I mean, look, it literally looked like a four inch cord. Uh, like you'd have to buy an extension cord, but no, the cord is wrapped around the inside of the base here, and basically you, you take the cord out of this little notch, and then you start unwrapping it from the inside here, this, this um, recess, or whatever you want to call this, and you just start gently unwind it. So it, it will come out, you don't have to force this, uh, and then of course when you come to the end, it shouldn't go any further back than the, the, the notch, just a safety measure. So don't try and pull it, because what's going to happen is people are going to start pulling on this, and they're going to destroy the, um, the coffee maker. So you do have cord. It's hidden. The instructions are worthless. Um, that's, that's the IDS-77. The IDS-55 that I had, uh, I, bought, I bought back on June 20th of 2014. It lasted me almost two years. And I'm a guy who drinks about eight to ten cups of coffee a day. Um, so I guess, yeah, for the money. I mean, I, I bought this from um, Walmart this morning for 18 bucks and then plus tax. So, yeah, this is, um, this is really very bizarre the way they've done this. Uh, I mean, I understand why they've done it this way, the IDS-77. But, um, yeah, the cord exists. He's got about a couple feet of cord. Not the four inches that initially shows out there. Take it out of the notch, unwind it from the recess in here gently, and then when you get about a, a couple of feet or so, then what you do is you go ahead and you back, put this back in the notch so you don't uh, pull on the um, pull on the motor and destroy anything. Good luck.